What's up, students? We got the Cursed Scepter. Here we go. You have a set budget of $130 to buy items priced at $240 each. Write and solve in inequality for this math situation. Okay, here we go. The solved inequality. Oh, oh, the solved inequality. Okay, nice. So we have to write it, solve it, and then just throw in our number right there. Okay, so hey, look at that. It's already kind of set up for us. Isn't that nice? All right, here we go. So set up is going to be the budget. So we have a budget of 130. So we have to spend less than or equal to 130. And it's $2.40 per item. I'm going to use X. X is the most famous uh, variable. Okay, each for every um, per. That usually means a multiplication. So here we go. Divided by 2.4, divided by 2.4. So the solved inequality is going to be x is less than or equal to. Doo -doo -doo. Ew. Nearest tenth. Okay, thank goodness. I was like, that's nasty. 54.2. 54.2. Okay, so that's the nearest tenth. Let me double check. Yep, the six would make you round up to a one. All right, the actual number of items you can buy. Ooh, ooh. Okay. You have to be less than or equal to 54.2. So let's assume that you can't buy a decimal of a thing. So what could you actually buy? Well, you can't buy 54.2 because that doesn't work. You can't buy a .2 of something. So you might have to go down less than to the next actual thing you can buy. So I think you could actually buy 54 items. So you're like, well, you could probably go up to 55. Well, let's double check here really quick. $2.40 times 55 things. Well, you went over budget. You went over budget. You only have 130, and you went over. Okay, 240 times 54. Hey, there we go. You're under budget. You made it. Okay, so sometimes, again, I'm trying to throw more questions at you where what do I do with the decimal? Well, just think logically. If you have to be under this number, you would go to the next number under it, whole number, which is 54. Some things in real life you can't have decimals of, so you might need to go to the whole number in that situation. All right, that's the cursed scepter.